So before I start talking about these interesting scenarios that are being flashed looking at the price action of Bitcoin in a different time frame using different scenarios, please guys, destroy that like button and to those individuals watching this for the first time, hit the subscribe button and the bell. Now looking at this price action of Bitcoin using Wyckoff distribution schematic event and phases, we can see guys the price in our case is clearly showing weakness and also a sign that we could be heading towards to form a new lower low because if you look at the price area if you look at this example on the right hand side we are finding ourselves in this phase e and once the price loses the support the horizontal trend line support then this will start another continuation here to the downside yes guys according to this distribution schematic from wyckoff's event and phases the price of bitcoin once it loses the support which we have around 28,000 to 29,000 range could be starting a new downtrend because we know to start a new move here like this first we need to form an accumulation phase yes guys according to the distribution schematic from wake of event and phases the price of bitcoin could head towards 24 25000 consolidate around that area before starting a new mark of phase type of formation so that's why guys that's why for us it's very very important that the price remains between 28000 to 29000 range at any cost because if we lose that support you can see this distribution schematic from wake of event and phases will play out and even if we look at this in a bit different way i mean if we simply use this descending channel here in a four hour time frame the upper trend line is considered as a strong line of resistance and lower trend line is considered as a strong line of support so in our case if the price of bitcoin loses the support which we have around twenty nine thousand, then we could be seeing another free fall type of movement where the price of bitcoin is going to drop below 28,000 and we know 28,000 is one of the most important line of support which we are not allowed to break at any cost because we know once we break below that area then all the bullish scenario which we have talked in my videos are going to be invalidated and price after that is expected to show lower highs lower lows continuation pattern type of formation before finding bottom before starting a new impulsive movement now even if we look at this in a bit different way i mean if we look at this using descending channel this lower trend line is the area where we could be getting attracted and even if you look at this using bullish descending broadening wedge nothing much has changed i mean once the price loses the support which you have around twenty eight thousand to twenty nine thousand, then this will be also looked as a continuation pattern before price again chooses a trend duration so for this continuation pattern also guys the price of bitcoin is not allowed to break below 28 29000 range because breaking below that area means we could be getting attracted towards this lower trend line from this descending broadening wedge before choosing a trend duration here like this so that's why that's why we have to be careful we have to monitor the price movement around 28000 to 29000 carefully because we know indicators like rsi macd t ccci all are flashing bearishness williams alligator indicator has already started this warning sign i mean this is a bearish crossover at the same time we have macd ttcci and rsi in a negative territory which is clearly indicating weakness so as long as this indicator remains bearish any sort of a really friendly in the media short term will be looked as a temporary really friendly because the price needs to show a bullish crossover like this to expect for another impulsive movement yes guys before we start with the new impulsiveness first the rsi must jump over 50 macd must form a bullish macd cross ttcci indicator in a positive territory once we see that happening then we know the price of bitcoin is going to start a new impulsive movement after that but for now this is a bearish rsi because rsi is below 50 level macd is bearish t3 cci also bearish because we are in a negative territory so right now indicators are clearly flashing weakness and even the williams alligator indicator is flashing weakness so that's why guys there is a very high probability of price testing the support around 28,000 and could go even lower but going lower than 28,000 could be a big big warning sign and why because if you look at this example here now before i switch the chart i just want to quickly aware you about this bybit world series of trading competition with total price pool of 8 million usdt and this 
registration period is going to end soon so please if you want to take part in this competition if you want to fight for this 8 million usdt joining my squad the link is in the description down below feel free to check it out or you can simply scan this qr code so in a bigger frame nothing must have changed i mean the price of bitcoin in the past price action also got rejected also showed a retracement between 0.5.618 fibonacci line before turning bullish so in our case if the price of bitcoin is going to do the same get attracted towards this 0.5.618 fibonacci line before breaking it to the upside then we are more than happy to see that because the price in the past price action after that formed a new higher high yes guys if the price of bitcoin after some retracement around 28,000, could find support above that range and start a new impulsive movement then we are expecting the price in our case to form another higher highs before choosing an actual trend duration so that's why guys that's why in a bigger frame the price of bitcoin does have strong line of support the rising trend line support and also the support from this fibonacci line the 0.5.61 fibonacci line around 28,000. so as long as we remain above that area any sort of a retracement will be looked as a temporary retracement so please be careful and do not be worried even if we see another continuation towards 28,000. only after breaking below that we know we are in actual danger not just only in a bigger frame even if we use this leading indicator according to this leading indicator the price in our case is in between the cpi lines and the first support line for the month of august which is around twenty eight thousand one hundred forty one dollar yes this twenty eight thousand one hundred forty one dollar will be looked as our upcoming target because the price is below the august cpi line but after the retracement around 28,000, we could be seeing an actual rally here in this manner because in a bigger frame, 28,000 is considered as a strong line of support and even the support from this monthly S1 line, which is around $28,141. Yes, guys, the price of Bitcoin as long as we remain over 28,000, there is no need to worry, there's no need to panic. But if we break below that, then we know this bullish scenarios in a bigger frames are going to be invalidated and price after that is expected to show another continuation to us 24 25000 range yes guys for the media short term as you can see even the broadening bottom is clearly indicating us the price in the past price action has found support whenever we have seen a retracement towards this lower trend line but in our case this lower trend line is again above 28000 so that's why as long as the price of bitcoin remains over 28000 or even shows a shakeout around 28000 we know we have some strong line of support and we could even see a move here like this price finally breaking out of this key line of resistance around 30000 and continue this new uptrend because we know the main price opportunity for bitcoin is between 35 to 40000 and only after getting attracted around that area we know we are going to decide the actual trend duration so let's hope for the best let's hope that the price in the media short term remains between 28,000 and 29,000. but if you want to show actual bullishness or invalidate the bearish scenarios which are lining up parallelly then we have to break out of 30,000 resistance line so these are some of the quick updates that i wanted to share with you in this video one more time guys i just want to again inform you about this bybit world series of trading competition and the registration is going to end on 17th of august so if you want to fight for this 8 million usdt joining my squad then the link is in the description down below feel free to check it out or you can simply scan this qr code that's it guys